Hi guys, this is Manish. Today, today I'm going to tell about uh, one interview scenario. So, so that is like uh, we have a source table that contains uh, duplicate rows also. It has a uh, duplicate rows as well as distinct. So we need to design a mapping to load all the unique rows in one target and the duplicate rows in another target. But duplicate rows occurring should be one. So uh, to do this, uh, I have a department table. So I have mock up, mocked up the data. This is in this card schema on this department CDC. If you uh, see this data, like accounting has two information. So BI has two information and other is a unique. So accounting and BI should go to a different should go to different table and the distinct should go to different table. This we have to achieve using Informatica Power Center. I already created uh, two tables. So with the same department name and name and number and location structure. So let's create a mapping for the same. I have already this uh, source metadata and target I have imported. Now I want to create a mapping M underscore dupes underscore distinct. So we are segregating dupes and distinct. Okay. Distinct. Okay. So drag and drop uh, department table. Okay. So if you think in Oracle like uh, how we can segregate it some grouping condition is required and count is required to segregate to identify whether the record is duplicate or not so i'm doing exactly same thing here with informatica like i'm adding uh, this aggregator select all click on aggregator go to ports so create group by for all because these are these three records is coming from source now I want to take count of these three records I'm grouping this and taking count while if, dupl if duplicate will come then it will it will be more than one so for that I'm adding one more port and I think count flag not flag actually count dupes so I'm making this uh, as integer an output port what should I write here see like count of one if the duplicate records will come more than one it has it will have more than one value okay apply it now after this what I need to do is I will take uh, I will use one expression okay now this count will tell whether record is distinct or a duplicate so what we need we need a router to route based on this count condition so in router I'm going to create two groups one is for distinct and another for duplicates okay okay 
so in filter condition of router I will use this count of uh, port for this thing I will use one and for duplicates I will use what greater than one it may it may the account may have three records four records we doesn't know so it should be more than one than duplicate okay click ok apply now these two targets so this uh, CDC TZT I am using for a uh, distinct record and uh, TG2 using for duplicate reports okay so mapping is valid okay create a workflow This is dupes and this thing. This one. Okay. Okay. Now double click on session and uh, give uh, source uh, relational connection and target on. Uh, we have eleven target. A table is present in batch 11 schema and so is in SCART schema okay then now start the task this one. go to run properties and check so total records was 8 and uh, in target 2, 2 records got inserted and in target 1, 4 records got inserted. So 2 records was this duplicate records, 2 records. Let me show in uh, database. So this TG2 is for the duplicate records. So accounting and BI, it has a duplicate records in source and this has distinct records. So you will not get uh, BI and account information here. So we uh, have segregated using Informatica. You go to source, this accounting and BI, it has only duplicates. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video.